Hi guys, hope you are happy to be back in Maldives because we have some breaking news for you. We officially screwed this vlog. Yeah, that's true. Everything that could have gone wrong today did it. But let's get back to the morning and we'll show you everything. To begin with, we plan to devote today's vlog to snorkeling and showing you more of the marine life here. But in the middle of the night we woke up from the severe thunderstorm and rain it was so bad that we had to go out to the terrace and rescue our clothes that were soaking wet outside and <laughs> i myself was so wet after several seconds that i had to use a towel it was literally like having a shower outside so yeah it was a bad signal but we weren't too upset at first and in the morning we went to breakfast just as we always do After breakfast I went to the local diving center and rented snorkeling gear for us, but there were some difficulties. They had no GoPros for rent. So today we were planning to do snorkeling and we rented all the gear for that but we wanted to rent one more thing and it was a GoPro or just something uh, that will help us to film underwater. We tried different options, we tried to ask guys at the snorkeling center, at the dive center uh, but they said like no we don't have anything like that. Uh, so now we're going to the shop and uh, we'll try our luck there. Probably they have some kind of cases for, I don't know, for iPhone maybe, something like that. Because uh, you were asking us uh, in previous vlogs like can you please show us more about marine life so we're trying to do our best to do that. Yay, so we found a solution for that. Actually, they have a whole range of GoPros, but obviously it's quite expensive to buy a GoPro just for one uh, snorkeling session. So we bought uh, just a waterproof case for a uh, smartphone. So we decided to test this case on Xenia's phone because she has this cheap iPhone 5. So field test number one. I literally washed her phone and it looks the same. So yeah, I guess it's ready for the real test. So we now have iPhone 6s plus in this case let's do this so it works okay the problem solved and we are finally going snorkeling well sort of because as soon as alex went into the water he choked with this water because apparently his mask wasn't working We went back to the diving center, of course, to have another mask, but it was closed for lunch. So we had nothing else to do but go to lunch as well. After lunch and with a new working mask, we finally went snorkeling. And guess what? 
It was so windy and the water wasn't transparent at all. We could hardly see any fishes there and here's everything we could do. several snorkeling points around Kuramathi Resort, so we decided to try our luck in the next one. The weather was better, it was not that windy and wavy, so we started to film. But Alex's iPhone with the largest memory you can even imagine was out of storage. And here are those couple of shots that he managed to do before that. sunset on a sandbank where you have to walk in the water but it's not going any deeper and it's just mind-blowing experience is that every day they have a different theme devoted to one particular country or an area in the world. For example, our first night it was an Asian Oriental style of cuisine, like they had Japanese, Vietnamese, Indian, um, all, all sorts of Chinese, all sorts of that food. Uh, the next day it was Italian, it was like pastas, lasagnas, all the amazing Italian dishes. And today, which is quite nice because it's last, our last evening at Kuramazi, we are having traditional local Maldivian food, so it's really nice to try something new and local. Yep, that's pretty much it for today, but <laughs> despite all the difficulties, we are really happy that we at least have something to show you. And we are pretty sure there are highs and lows in any trip, and tomorrow is gonna be way better. Stay tuned because we are daily vlogging from Maldives. So we'll see each other soon. Bye bye!